How's it going everybody? Dustin here, Faith Farm Adventures. Uh, if you, uh, before we get started, if you haven't hit the like button and subscribe, I'd greatly, greatly appreciate it. We've got this John Deere 4400 uh, combine that's long since been retired, but we had bought it a couple years ago, drove it over here, had a uh, nice diesel engine in it, so I've been planning on pulling it out and uh, selling the engine, so, and uh, got some footage of pulling the engine out. It's uh, by no means the most uh, efficient, or definitely not the way you want to do it if you'd ever want to put it back in, but it was an uh, easy way to get it out, get it sold, and uh, get my investment back out of it. Because we use this, uh, not for a combine, but for just display. And uh, we've also got stairs and a slide on the side of it so kids can uh, they can go climb up in the combine, go down a slide, and uh, kids really enjoy it. It's pretty neat. I've got a lot of work to do to it still yet. I'd really like to paint the combine, pretty it up, maybe put another slide out the back of it. But at one point in time, this was uh, state of the art, but that is long since gone. So we did our part recycled the engine so uh, somebody else could get some use out of their combine and uh, made a little money in the process so here's the footage hope you enjoy it like i said if you haven't subscribed hit the subscribe button uh, greatly appreciate it thanks the engine in this 4400 john deere is a six cylinder 329 diesel this particular model has got extremely low hours for its age and we have repurposed it to a man who's going to put it in a tractor and we'll recoup uh, a lot of our investment and we're going to show you how to remove it here today all right we're going to get all the panels off where we can take a look at what we're going to, have to do Now we can get a better look at everything we've got to take off. So we can start getting this engine out. We're going to get the radiator and exhaust off and fuel lines. So we're going to get started. Thank you. 
It's Dustin here again. We are on day two, or evening two, I should say, on the John Deere 4400 combine engine removal. We got started last night, got a decent pile of parts off. Tonight we're gonna try and start working on the motor mounts and the drive system, which is gonna be buried way up in there.
it's the end of night three. We're about three hours into this project and we've got the motor separated from the drive system. Hanging here. And we're going to call it a night and uh, pick it out of here tomorrow.